beautiful April day today. It's actually the day after 420 that I'm recording this right now. For the pre-frosh who are watching this video, you guys requested a room tour of the freshman dorms. I don't know if it's too late now or not to figure out where you want to live, but I'm going to show you all the dorms that Hopkins has to offer for the freshmen. Right now, I'm actually heading to AMR2 right now. I just woke up, honestly, at like 11 a.m. I'm not really a role model. I'm a college student, if you were wondering. <laughs> to my freshman year and uh, I really liked it a lot but I, we got to get a perspective of a current <laughs> freshman right now so what are your thoughts on AMR2 and should I, people go to AMR2 in general? I really like AMR2 I like that the entire floor is like all connected so I really feel like I get to meet everyone on the floor and there's definitely like a community of people just at least on the floor. Okay I see. Uh -huh. Do you live in AMR2? Yes. I do. What are the perks of living in AMR2? It's just like in the beginning you get to meet a lot of people so that's really nice because like it's college and no one knows anyone but then like that becomes really annoying because like it's two in the morning and you can't go to sleep. Yeah, because lots of people talking. talk in the hallways. I think it's good like as a freshman because you get to meet everyone. Mm -hmm. like, that was and like fun. everyone, especially like around orientation is like super open and just like yeah. doing yeah. with people. Like we went to like a party together and like I wouldn't yeah, have done that yeah. if I had not known you. Sometimes I wish I was in Woolman. <laughs> like uh, not all the time. Oh right now I want to be in Woolman because like I just want to have my own place and like not yeah. like traditional style, uh -huh. but for the whole first semester I liked Amar too. Best part of AMR One. Best part of AMR One, definitely the social aspect of it. I feel like people are really like, everyone's like really in the hallways. The door, everyone's door is kind of open. Everyone's just yeah. chilling. Whether it's homework or like whether or not people are going out on a Friday night, like everyone's just always here. You can text people and stuff like that. I have a question. So, okay. So AMR Two people, they said that. uh AMR2 people. They said that it was also social. So what? why AMR1 over AMR2? Why AMR1 over AMR2? Oh. Honestly, honestly, AMR2, they're a little wild, okay? You want to have oh, that good balance. Real. You, you got to have the balance. You know, you got to have the academics and you got yeah. to have the social. AMR2 is like, that's the weekend dorm, right? Yeah. And if you want that, sure, go for it. Go okay, for it. Okay, okay. But if you want the people who you can grind with till 2, 3 in the morning and they're always there for you, but are still ready to go on a Saturday night, AMR1 is the place to be. What's it called? Work hard, play hard. Work hard, play hard. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> yeah, you got it, you yeah. got it. One of the things that I never liked about AMR2 um, Two is that okay? These doors, right? Yeah. They, they, when you open them, they stay open. Okay. Yeah. And AMR two. Once you open the door, it like it just closes automatically if you don't have anything like stopping you. I would literally have to put like a box right here every single time I wanted to keep my door open. Yeah, exactly. And it just gets annoying because like I'm just gonna walk out of my room and be like, oh, oh shit, like, oh, sh like, like exactly. Like, it's a recycle bin, like. So I'm from AMR2 though. Yeah. I don't want to like roast it too much, but that's just that's just the thing I I get tight about. You gotta speak the truth though, you yeah. know. I like the, I gotta let the pre frosh know the truth. Exactly. One thing I don't like about AMR1. Mm -hmm. These chairs. Really? They don't they don't have wheels on them. Wait, AMR2 has wheels they, on their yeah, chairs. AMR2 has wheels on their chairs, and that makes you like you could just like roll around your room. But here, like, what am I gonna do, like? I mean, you can rock. You, can you rock. got the rocking you rock. mechanism, you know? And it's also more comfy, though. Exactly. Aren't as comfy. So you claim that there's a family of mice in your room? You can barely see it, but there's the mice, like... Oh uh, it's like that little piece in the... Yeah, 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 yeah. Like bottom, like, bottom left corner, right? Yeah, basically, we couldn't catch the mice the whole night, and then it, like, ran out of the room and underneath my door, so we oh, gave yeah. up. But then, like, two days later, I woke up, and it was just walking around in my trash can. Alright, so I'm waiting for one of my boys, Kevin Chiro, right now. Uh, he's about to show me what AMR3 dorms are going to look like. As you can see, 
We're right in front of FFC, and behind me, behind these stairs, is AMR3. This is AMR3 right here. This is 3A, and that's 3B over here. In my opinion, I think both places have similar room layouts, so we're gonna be checking out AMR3B, which is where my man Kevin, who's holding All right, the camera right let's now, let's get it. Let's right get it. Right here, yeah. Yeah. That's All right. Where his room is gonna All be. right, let's go. By chairs that roll. Some places don't have rolling chairs. Oh, facts. They got AMR1, they got the chairs you can't even roll. Yeah, 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 and facts. You just, just want to roll around the room sometimes. You, know, you, need, you need that freedom. <laughs> so, this furniture right here, this is like, right, this is like AMR1 level cabinets, but AMR2 level chairs. Facts. Alright, that's the thing. One uh, plus two, is, one plus two equals three. That is true. Yeah. <laughs> what are we saying? <laughs> I don't know. What's a reason why people should? Go to AMR3. Alright, so if you think about it, as you can see, it's like kind of in the middle of the AMR1 and like Woolman. So like it's a, it's, it's a suite, but then you're also kind of next to the FFC, so you have that availability. But again, for the social part, it's not the most social of the dorms, so you have to, you know, think nice. about that. We got those double sinks though. Yeah, the double sinks though. The double yeah. sinks. <laughs> oh, OP. <laughs> I have a question for you. As a woman resident, why should a freshman live in Woolman? Well, I feel like if you're looking for something that's more homey, Woolman is like a better option because it's like basically a mini apartment. You have like your own little common space and then you get separate rooms instead of like AMRs where you kind of just like, you literally have a room and that's it. Like you don't have any other place to like chill out. Um, you also get your own bathroom. So I think that makes like doing your business a little bit more like comfortable. And you get a kitchen, so if you want to like cook, especially when I come home late and like all the places are closed, like you can cook for yourself. Okay, so that was basically a housing tour. Uh, if you want to see more about McCoy, which is the other dorm, you can look at my sophomore housing video because that's also where sophomores have to live too. So you check that out. Basically, it's kind of similar to Woolman in my opinion. But yeah, for those of you who are about to become freshmen at Hopkins, I hope this video really helped you deciding where you want to live. Hope you liked the students' insight and also the room tour and how everything looked. So, uh, yeah, time to study. So what exactly is this diagram over here? So this is my freshman dorm um, at Peabody, which I no longer attend. And 